at the train station. Hopefully, I make it to my destination. It's been kind of crazy. Three flights, and then I had to pay for a bus to the train. But now I just gotta wait for the train. Another 20, 20, 30 minutes. So hopefully I make it. We'll see how it goes. This is crazy. Fuck all you hoes. Get a grip, motherfucker. Yeah. This album is dedicated to all the teachers that told me I never amount to nothing. To all the people that lived above the buildings that I was hustling in front that called the police on me when I was just trying to make some money to feed my daughter. And all the niggas in the struggle. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> It's all good, baby, baby. Uh. It was all a dream. I used to read Word Up magazine. Something pepper and heavy D up in the limousine. Hanging pictures on my wall. Every Saturday, rap attack, Mr. Magic Molly Mall. I let my tape rock till my tape pop. Smoking weed and bamboo, sipping on private stock. Way back when I had the red and black lumberjack with the hat, the mask. Remember rapping Duke? The hard, the hard. You never thought that hip hop would take it this far. Now I'm in the limelight cause I rhyme tight Time to get paid, blow up like the world trade Born sinner, the opposite of a winner Remember when I used to eat sardines for dinner Peace to Raw G, Brucey B, Kick the Free Funk, Master Flex, Love Bug, Star Ski I'm blowing up like you thought I would Call a crib, same number, same hood It's all good uh. And if you don't know, now you know, nigga uh. Personal with Robin Leach, and I'm far from cheap. I smoke stuff with my peeps all day. Spread love, it's the Brooklyn way. The Moet and Alize keep me pissy. Girls used to diss me, now they write letters cause they miss me. I never thought it could happen, this rapping stuff. I was too used to packing gats and stuff. Now honeys play me close like butter play coke. From the Mississippi down to the East Coast. Condos and Queens, in dough for weeks. Sold out seats to hear Biggie Small speak. Living life without fear Putting five carrots in my baby girl ear Lunches, brunches, interviews by the pool Considered a fool cause I dropped out of high school Stereotypes of a black male misunderstood And it's still all good, uh And if you don't know, now you know, nigga Genesis. When I was dead broke, man, I couldn't picture this 50-inch screen, money green, leather sofa Got two rides, a limousine with the chauffeur Phone bill about 2 G's flat No need to worry, my accountant handles that And my whole crew is lounging Celebrating every day, no more public housing Thinking back on my one-room shack Now my mom pips a act with me on the back and she loves to show me off, of course Smiles every time my face is up in the sauce We used to fuss when the landlord dissed us No heat, wonder why Christmas missed us Birthdays was the worst days Now we sip champagne when we thirsty uh, Damn right I like the life I live Cause I went for negative to positive And it's all And if you don't know, now you know, nigga uh. Uh, uh. And if you don't know, now you know, nigga. Yo, you see this? Brand new Illico racks. This is just the warm up room. So fresh, it's hard to move it. <sighs> well, just gotta weigh in so I can freaking eat. I made weight. <laughs> Time to unmake weight. Mm-hmm. 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 I mean, I don't know.
forward for the APF. James Vang from the US of A looking at 270 kilograms. Again, 595 pounds. No wonder his best lift from the uh, US APL Championships this year at 280. So he finished first in his weight class. Good depth. Yeah, that should be a big smile on his face. Yes. And it is it's three white lights. Still 270 on the bar. He'll be happy with that. Yusuke Kyuchi from Japan looking at 270 as well. And of course, 10 kilo increase from his first. Yeah, and your 10 kilo increase yeah, is, is, body weight, yeah, it's, not and it's fairly conservative yeah. for a, an equipped lift. And you'll often watch equipped lift and you'll see some bigger jumps. Uh, they'll open as quite the week, light. As they'll, the week goes by, we will see this happen. And we certainly will. It'll make some adjustments to your equipment. You can take those slightly bigger jumps in equipped lifting than you can in brawl. Uh, but 280 for a 66 kilo lifter. Glad kick has put in a 305 for a second attempt. Takes that deep breath in. Yes. Slow drive from the bottom. That looks good. That looks like a solid lift. And the referees say yes. Perfect squat, yeah. Absolutely spot on the money there. The 280 stays in the bar for Yasuki Kuchi from Japan. So you'll often hear us talking about timed out or you've got 30 seconds. The general rule in powerlifting, your first one should be a nice easy opener. Your second attempt is what you're looking for in training. Yep, and, and your, your third, third one should be a bonus. You know, third's your opportunity to take a little bit of crack at a personal best, yeah. as he's doing here. So this will be five kilos on top of his previous personal best. Looking for 285. And playing a smart, long game. Being consistent, getting them on the board. And seeing what happens to everyone else. And that's the thing yeah. with powerlifting. It can be so unpredictable. If you're consistent, you can find yourself walking away with a medal. Absolutely. You get nine for nine, now you're going to be zero, zero bait. You so give yourself well, a yeah. shot. Uh, yeah, that's good. And this Again. looks he good. He just got a little bit off at the top there. Did he lock his knees back I out? Oh, he's got it. ref said he has. I don't think he was locked. Up that's yet. enough. Let's look at the replay. I don't think he was lucky. Hey. He's got the decent. He was very smooth yeah, all the way in. through. That was in. Did he lock the knees? Nah. To me, he was still... Yeah, going forward. it's but difficult it's okay. to tell from it's the camera okay. angles and these angles. Yeah. Uh, so James Vang from the USA looking at 190 kilograms, just a smidge under his personal best, but he has missed his opening lift. He has missed his second lift. And so this he, is a must, yeah. He He's has like put himself this one. under enormous pressure Absolutely. Absolutely. to get this on the board or his total does not count. Cannot register a total nope. without a lift in all three disciplines. So he needs this. And this is why picking that opening lift is so, so important. important. Come on. You can do Everything must be tight. Better control. Drive. That looks better. Has he got it? I'm not oh, sure if he locked it out. Let's wait and see. Yes, he does. He gets yes. two white lights. And breathes a size of relief there. Just saves his skin. And Nanti Savalonen from Finland, 202.5. Called deadlift in this class is 317.5. And the total record, I, I think that could also go today. Could well go. It's 815.5 yeah. kilograms. And he gets that on the board at 252 and a half. It should be white lights all across, this and it is. is. 
Suzuki Arianta from Indonesia too. Two hundred and sixty five kilograms on the bar. Gets it to the top, gets the down command. Yes, and gets yes. the three white lights on the board. Vicky Arianto from Indonesia, two hundred and eighty kilograms. Now he missed his yeah. opening lift at two seventy. Yeah. So it's interesting to go. Huge, huge standard of lifting here yeah, already is. today, and we're yeah. only in the first session. First day. Gets Lucky it to that. the top. He's locked it by the look of it. He gets a down command. Let's see what the referees say. And yes. he gets it on the board. Yes, he Three has. Three white lights. There's some change coming in. I yes, think we, we don't see because some change coming in. They got two ch two changes. Now we start to see them This is where around. the jostling position is going on. So, Sergei yeah. Glankic has actually dropped his back to two. Yeah, All think. right, it's Wednesday. Bed is clean. Packed, and it's time to leave Sweden back to the USA. I mean, what can I say? I felt like I could have done a lot better. You know, I think my numbers were a little conservative, but it didn't technically matter because I wouldn't have done any better because I messed up on two of my lifts so you can just imagine like i could have been way stronger but because i missed two lifts that set me back you know and when you're at the world level missing one lift you know sets you back like a mile so you can imagine if you miss two you pretty much ain't gonna do good anyway so i had the strength to come like third place this year but you know that's why it's worlds you know if i was strong enough to you know just get the placing that i thought i could get then the competition wouldn't matter right we'll just put imaginary numbers on like say hey I could probably squat like a thousand, so why don't I just write down a thousand, right? Yeah, but what can I say? Can't really be upset because it's the best I've ever done in my life. And, you know, I did it in the strictest federation. You know, got to squat ultra deep. Bench press pauses were extra long. They make you hold your deadlifts long. So, uh, I should just be happy. And next time I come back, wherever the world brings me or takes me, I will be a better man. And I will be looking forward to one of the top places but until then i'm just a big shit talker making excuses but leave my airbnb walking to the bus So, all right. So once I had that, I could come back to the country.
that's it folks peace